So it is now time to name our stars of the night, and I guess I am up first, and we are going to stay right here in Hazard. We're going to give it to a Perry Central Commodore. First game back since missing two games after the debacle over at the versus Sheldon Clark, we'll call it. <laughs> Daryl Prey, or Daryl Prey, Darryl wow. Prey. <laughs> Daryl Beatty, Prey's make so many plays. Daryl Beatty, eight catches, 187 yards, and three TDs. So he is my star of the night. My first one is going to go to James Campbell and Casey Sparkman of North Central. They hooked up last night on a fourth down play to beat Jackson County. The come from behind win for the Patriots. Quarterback James Campbell tied in Casey Sparkman for North Central. Hey, let's add another Leslie sticker to this helmet. We've got a couple on here, I think, from Blake Bray. But uh, this one this time, we're going to give it to Ethan Horton. Coach called in. We do not have his numbers, per se, as far as yardage is concerned, but he did throw seven touchdown passes, so that is enough not to bad. be my star of the night. Williamsburg sophomore wide receiver Skyler Griffith. Check out these numbers in the Yellow Jackets win over Berea. Seven catches, 181 yards, two touchdowns. He also added a rushing touchdown. Oh, and a 57-yard interception return for a touchdown for the young sophomore. Well, congratulations. It is now time for our WYMT Player of the Week for Week 7 of the high school.